Good morning everyone! How are you guys doing? I hope you're doing well. If you're new here, my name is Adelica and today it's Saturday morning, I need to get ready and I thought why not get ready and just answer some this or that questions uh, on fall because we're in September and I feel like <laughs> autumn and fall is soon here or is here. I'm not sure, but I am so excited for fall this year. So I just want to chat about autumn and doing my makeup. And yeah, that is what we're going to do today. We are going to use the Nomad Cosmetics, let's see here, Hudson Valley palette. I'm going to show you quickly how it looks. It is the perfect autumn palette. So this is what we're going to use. And yeah, uh, if this is the first time here, by the way, on my channel, it's a little bit of everything. I started off with just makeup content, but now I actually have vlogs. I usually do one vlog a week and then I do makeup content, but I also do fashion related videos because I love clothes, I love bags. I do have these bag videos that I show you guys some alternative to the designer handbag. So I have a little bit of everything here. So check it out. If you like it, subscribe. <laughs> but let's go ahead and get started. So I have some autumn this and that I found on the internet that I am going to just... Um, just choose. So first of all, I'm gonna try this one. Uh, I mean, I have this one in my collection. I don't know if it's old, but this is from Origins and this is the Pore Perfecting Cooling Primer with Willow Herb. And I loved this one, but I'm scared because you have to shake it and then it comes out as a mousse and then it's really, really cold on your skin. But I'm very scared with the pump. <laughs> I'm gonna pump if it's gonna go everywhere. This is how it looks. Oh, it's so cool. Oh my god. Yeah, I do remember I really like this one because it's it's so cooling on your skin and it smells so so good. I remember this was so hyped because Nick Tutorials was using this one and talking about this one. And I know a lot of people didn't like it, like hated it. <laughs> I was one of those people that actually liked this one. And I'm gonna do a stick foundation today. This is from Bare Minerals. I love this one. Uh, this is the Complexion Rescue Hydrating Foundation Stick. And this is in Butter, butter <laughs> Cream number three. Okay, so let's start, guys. So the first question, or this or that, is going out for coffee or getting cozy inside? <laughs> I'm kind of both, but now these days I love to be home. So I would definitely say get cozy inside because I do love to be at home and I love when it's autumn to just light some candles and be inside, have a nice coffee or tea, just cozy up in the couch, <laughs> watch a movie or just YouTube, something that just makes me relax. So I would definitely say actually getting cozy inside. I don't know, tell me down below how you are. Do you like to go out and have a coffee. I think that is so nice as well. But because we don't live in the city center, I feel like it is like a, I don't go to the city center just to have a coffee. Uh, if I go there, I have an errand. Maybe I need to go to a specific store or I wanna go shopping and go to the actual stores and not just uh, buy online. And then, of course, I always have a fika and, you know, getting a uh, lunch or something and watch people. And I really, really enjoy that. But if I've lived, uh, because we lived in the city center before, if I still would live there, I would definitely do that more often. Go out and just have a coffee uh, and just watch people because that is so nice as well. But <laughs> yeah, that's not the situation we have. Uh, right now where we live. I'm actually gonna take this one. I have this still in my collection. It's from She Glam. I don't buy from She Glam anymore. But this is so good. I am so sad because yeah, you know all the She In, She Glam thing, you know, I don't want to support it, but I have a lot of makeup still from that brand. And I must say this is really good. <laughs> it breaks my heart because I really want to repurchase it, but really deep inside, I don't want to do it. So, but <laughs> Anyways, this is from She Glam and this is the, um, the shade Cotton Candy. It's a concealer and it's so, you can see I have scratched, so I hope I can get anything up here because it's almost out and I really love it. 
that much so I have scraped <laughs> the inside so I can get something out. That's is how much I actually like this one and the perfect shade as well. I don't have I don't have a concealer with a perfect shade. I feel like that is a problem for me to find, but this one is the perfect shade as well, so that is so typical. <laughs> but anyway, uh I I need to like throw this soon because it's you could see it's almost nearly anything left in that <laughs> in that bottle. So yeah, I don't know. I don't know how She Glam is compared to Shein because Shein, I don't know if you saw that documentary about Shein, but maybe there is a lot, but how they do their clothes and how they, the workers at the, um, where they do these clothes have it, it's horrible. But I don't know in the makeup industry because yeah, but you, you're still supporting kind of the brand if you buy, of course. So maybe in the factory where they have the makeup, maybe the workers, they don't work that many hours and so on. But still, you're still supporting the main brand, I suppose. So yeah, I don't know. Let's uh, let's just continue. <laughs> We're going with Chi Glam again. I love this one as well. I cannot deny it. So this is their liquid bronzer or something like, uh, yeah, uh, something like that. Uh, sun sculpting liquid bronzer and this is in Golden Sun and I'm going to mix it with this one. This is from Revolution and this is the Goddess Glow in light. So two cream bronzers so we're gonna use. Okay. <laughs> Next question. Sunny and cold days or rainy days? Oh my god, that is that is so easy. I don't know. Are you a rainy day person? I am not. So I would choose every day like <laughs> cold but sunny. I mean cold and sunny is the perfect. Sometimes I actually want uh, rainy days of course because it's cozy and you just want to snuggle up in the couch and watch a movie and all that but most of the days I feel like oh this is so dirty most of the days uh, when it's autumn I feel like I I do love when I can see the sun a little bit because it gets very very dark here in Sweden like pitch black <laughs> it gets really 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 dark and then it's actually really nice to see the sun because uh, yeah we don't see a lot of sun in those months now in sweden i must say it has been like summer here in south of sweden sweden is a very long <laughs> a very long country as i mean in the north it's very high up they had so much snow the other day like like a lot like this it came like in one day and we had 25 degrees celsius guys like summer <laughs> and this is in the same country i mean it's so crazy it's really really crazy and you actually can go to north of sweden like you can fly and then you can like you can go there uh in a few hours uh so you can actually go there for snow and then you can travel to south of Sweden and you can like not laying on the beach but 25 degrees yeah I, probably you can do that <laughs> and that's so crazy you can experience that crazy weather this is so beautiful I love these two together I must say this these products uh, but yeah so it's super crazy I mean <laughs> that is the climate or what do you say like you know how it is these days I don't know when you think about it it's it's quite depressing actually um, why this is happening but yeah we're not gonna talk about that today we're gonna talk about autumn <laughs> okay so we have one more here well we have I have a lot of these um, watch a movie or reading a book oh it is so hard but if you have been here I have talked about this and since I got Ellie my daughter she's eight now I haven't read a, a, 
I read a lot of books before, but I haven't had the time to do it. This summer I actually read a book and it was amazing. It was on vacation, but I feel like I don't have the time and now I've started working out as well. But watching a movie, because that I can do with my husband. So we watch a lot of movies. So I would say watch a movie, but I do love to read. So if I would choose like this or that, uh, what I do is I watch movies because if I have a book I need to read it not just that moment uh, Film is like two hours, but it has to take me a lot of days to finish a book. So uh, But I I love to read so it's really hard to To say if what I enjoy most actually <laughs> because I enjoy both but maybe movie then because it's easier for me. Okay, I took out this one. This is from Lethal Cosmetics and I have custom this myself. You can actually do that. I think you can do that still on their website. So you can buy like this magnetic like little face palette and then you can just put in whatever you want. So I put in two blushes. This is a very orange as you can see. This is a yellow and uh, beautiful. So I am going to use the blushes. I'm going to start with this one and see if I can use this one because <laughs> these are super pigmented but I don't know what I feel about this, um, this yellow anymore. I, I'm not sure. I think it's cool but you know this is also very yellow leaning as you can see so maybe this is enough this like orange this is beautiful maybe i'm gonna pull in another one as well as you can see this is very it's beautiful but it's very yellow leaning but maybe and very pigmented uh yeah but let's move on <laughs> okay next one big and cozy sweater or big and cozy blankets oh that is so hard, I must say. It is really, really hard because we have so many blankets in our house. We have, I think, four throw pillows in our couch. <laughs> it's like, it's so easy to just get one if you are a little bit, a little bit cold or want to cozy up in the couch. So I always have that. And I love to have cozy sweaters, but I would say blankets. I would say blankets because that is... Uh, what I usually use when I'm in the couch. I feel like it's super cozy. This looks really pretty. I want to blend it out. With, let's use this highlighter as well. This one from Lethal. It's also very pretty. It's a little more like gold leaning. Works really nice with this, uh, this blush here. Yeah, so definitely a blanket like throw pillow, no, throw blanket. Did I say throw pillow? I mean throw blankets. I have four throw blankets in, in our couch. Anyways, let's move on to the next one. A cup of tea or hot chocolate? I would say a cup of tea uh, because uh, hot chocolate is really, really nice. I never, like, I, I don't drink that that often, but tea I drink every night, like in the evening when... Ellie is asleep. Jonas and I always have a cup of tea. It's so nice. And yeah, I'm sitting in the sofa and usually I just editing videos or watch YouTube or watch something on the TV. So and we have our tea. <laughs> so yeah, uh, definitely tea for me. I love tea. I love coffee. Coffee I need in the morning. I would never switch out coffee or tea for coffee in the morning uh, or like in the daytime but in the evening I love a cup of tea and next one is cinnamon or pumpkin spice to be totally honest I I have never had like a pumpkin spice latte like a real one I have like bought from Nespresso because we have a Nespresso uh, machine uh, like a pumpkin spice cake latte flavor but that is not like I don't think that is like the real 
tasty flavor that you get if you get one from Starbucks maybe or I don't know where you get it. Here in Sweden we don't have that and I hope they may have it this year maybe in one of these like coffee shops. <laughs> but it's not that big in Sweden so I cannot tell you guys if I like it or not so I have to say cinnamon but I do want to try the pumpkin spice. That is really something I want. Okay let's dig into this one. My thing I was thinking of doing is kind of a halo eye but maybe wing it out a little bit here because I think that suits my eye but I'm gonna start setting this a little bit with this one and I'm gonna blend it out a little bit with this one like I'm gonna take these so it doesn't get too pigmented I'm gonna take this green now and just start here in the crease. Okay, what else do we have? I had a lot here. I mean, you can just search on the internet. Let's see here, pumpkins or pressed leaves? Okay, so this is probably like, if for decor and stuff, what do you prefer? I prefer pumpkins. Uh, I don't know, have you seen my vlog, my latest vlog? Because in my latest vlog, I usually post vlogs on Fridays by the way. <laughs> uh, but in my latest vlog I decorated for fall in our home and you could see I had a few pumpkins there and I think pumpkins definitely is like when you think about autumn I think about pumpkins. So <laughs> yeah definitely pumpkins for me. I think it's they are adorable kind of like it's <laughs> are cute. I don't know what to say. They look cute and I actually is growing uh, in the garden pumpkins. Uh, I have two <laughs> but I hope there will be a lot more but I think they are uh, you can harvest them a little bit later so maybe they will there will be more. I hope so anyway. Look how beautiful this is. I mean this green is just amazing. I'm going to show you which one it is. It's this one here. This is so beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. I'm going to take this one now and deepen up a little bit. Just in the outer and inner part. Okay, walk through the woods or exploring the city. Okay, uh, this is a hard one. In the autumn time, like in autumn, I would prefer the woods. Definitely, but in the summer, I love the city as well. Go like if the if it's great weather and you know in summertime, you have a coffee, iced coffee or ice cream. You go uh, just walk around in the city. I love that. I love it. But in the winter time and autumn, when it's colder and I don't know, uh, I am not that big of a fan to just walk around in the city center then I go to the mall if I want to do errands in stores so I would definitely say uh, walk around in the woods or what did you say walk through the woods <laughs> I would definitely choose that in the autumn if you ask me in summertime it would definitely be the other way around maybe but no I love to go to the woods actually I mean our family like me and Jonas and Ellie actually we are not like these you know people who goes to the woods and you know hiking and stuff a lot we go in our regular clothes maybe sneakers we are not like dressed up for like five hours uh, trekking thing in the woods so <laughs> We are definitely not those people, but uh, but we definitely enjoy being out uh, in nature because we do love nature. We love the woods. We love the like exploring the country and be outside. So we are something in between, I would say. So we're not those hardcore like trekking people or people, you know. <laughs> <laughs> it's nothing wrong with that at all. Uh, maybe it sounds like that, but no. Um, but we are not those those people. If you know, if you know what I mean, I hope you do. Uh, and I don't offend anyone because I don't mean that it's not good to be that kind of person. But <laughs> we're not. We are not those people that do that. But 
We love to be out in the woods. You could see I am trying here <laughs> to do, these are not even, but I try to do a little wing here as well, like a halo eye with a wing. And I'm not sure how it's going, but uh, maybe we need to clean up a little bit. We definitely need to clean up a little bit <laughs> after this, but okay. Maybe I can take this one and just do like a liner. Maybe that will be better. I don't know. We, as I said, we need to clean up this mess. I don't know if I actually want to make it darker because we can do it with this palette. I love this palette, guys. It's still available, what I could see on the website, but um, we could deepen it up with this one if we want it, but I think this is good. I'm just gonna take my finger on this one and then I'm just gonna be very, not precise, but just like dot it a little bit here in the middle and try to blend it. Now I maybe took too much. Like, I'm just gonna do like that. Look at that. This is just with the fingers, very. Okay, mm, what I can see, I need to take that other green we had and the first green we had in the crease and I'm just gonna blend it a little bit here so oh, what a beautiful look I love looks like this okay we're gonna do the under eyes we're gonna take the mats that we had and then we have a question or this or that cookies or apple pie <laughs> I love sweets I love sweets so I uh, I actually would say apple pie. Apple pie with like vanilla sauce. Do you say that? In Sweden we have like a vanilla sauce uh, you put on. Uh, tell me down below what you have. Uh, do you even say that in English? <laughs> uh, but we have that anyway and I, yeah, I love that. I love cookies as well, like freshly baked cookies, but I almost never bake cookies. Sometimes I do actually. If I'm in the evening, if I'm really, really like craving uh, newly baked cookies, I can just do them very quickly. I mean, it's not that hard to do cookies. Like if you just have flour, butter and sugar, of course, uh, you can just and baking powder, you can just do cookies and it will be very easy and quick to do. Sometimes I do that, but I feel like apple pie, I do pies a lot. I have apple pie. Um, I do, uh, oh, now I can't, Kruspar. I will put the name of Kruspar. Kruspar is in Swedish, I cannot remember the name. And of course, rhubarb pie and you know, everything we have in the garden, I love to do pies on <laughs> I love to do that so yeah now I'm gonna clean up with my two face this is the one I always use you have seen it a hundred times if you have been here but this is the multi complexion powder this is just perfect for cleaning up uh, candles or fairy lights uh, like real candles I will say I before we got Ellie I had a lot of actually real candles, always lightened, but when we got Ellie, I mean when she was little, you couldn't have real candles out, I mean it would be a disaster. As you can imagine, now she's eight and I still doesn't, I light candles sometimes. Uh, I do have these uh, like candles that have a scent, uh, like smell, with a nice smell, so I put that, but just regular candles. We haven't had regular candles lightened for a very long time, but yesterday actually I took out some, you know the small ones, I took out some of these and lighted up and it was so cozy, so we're gonna start doing that because she's eight now, so it's not, it's not, our, at least not a problem, but we just stopped doing that and then we I think we don't think about it. We just have these LED uh, candles that you have battery on, but real candles are really, really cozy. So yeah, I would say um, 
What was it? Uh, candle, uh, no, fairy lights. Is fairy lights like LED lights, maybe? I would say that because we don't use real candles that much, but I am going to do that now because I would so much prefer real candles because it's so, so cozy. Okay, guys, I think I'm gonna finish the eyes off camera and then I'm gonna come back and then we're gonna do the lips. Okay, the eyes are done. I really, really love this look. This is so beautiful and I, what I love, because halo eyes, if you do them not winged out, if you do them like the proper way, I don't know. but I think my eyes get really, really small because I have small eyes, so I love when I wing it out a little bit and I thought, yeah, it works actually. Okay, let's do the lips. I took out this one from Colourpop. This is a beautiful autumn shade and this is in Punch Bowl. This is the Ultra Matte Lip. And I also took out this Kaya Cosmetics Luvisa Lip Pencil. I, I don't know if this one is going to work, but I do think so. So this is going to dry down, but this is a beautiful, beautiful shade. So I'm gonna give you a close-up of this look. Okay, here is the finished look. What do you think? I, I absolutely love it. I love this green and I love the lip. I, yeah, and the blush is really, really pretty right now. I mean, I didn't need to go in with another one, but it's very, very orange, like yellow leaning orange. <laughs> and yeah, super beautiful. I hope you have enjoyed this little get ready with me talking about this or that for autumn. I think it's so much fun. I have to do this on Christmas as well, <laughs> like winter or Christmas, because I did it for summer, I think, actually. I have a video on that. Maybe I will try to link it or maybe you can just search on my channel. But thank you for being here, guys. I hope you have an amazing day wherever you are, whatever you're doing, rest of the day. And yeah, I see you in my next one. Take care, guys. Bye.